Hey, thanks for meeting me. I appreciate it. You kidding me? I'm not passing up a chance to hurt Ultor. What you got for me? I know about some things Ultor wants to keep buried. Honey, I got shit to do. I don't have time for poetics. Hey, who's being poetic? I'm talking about bodies. Well, why didn't you say so? Find the first body yet? It's been like 30 seconds. What's the rush? Well, I'd like you to find the damn things before a Masako team comes after me. How do you know about these bodies? Does it matter? Seeing as I'm about to get shot trying to get them, hell yeah. I used to work for Ultor. How? I didn't think Dane had girls like you on retainer. I worked at the pyramid as a microbiologist, you judgmental prick. A what? Read a book. This just keeps getting better. to apologize what the hell did you do to these people I guess you found the first one huh what was left of him Altor has been experimenting with nanites the hope was to find a way to increase a miner's lung capacity and when I saw what they were doing to volunteers I understand when you get them all drop the bodies off at channel 6 once the media runs the story Altor is finished the wrong crew to fuck with! Would tell me about it.
balls. Did you have any problems? Nothing I couldn't handle. Good. So now what? We wait for Jane Valderrama to pick up the story. You think she's gonna run it? Channel 6 didn't exactly go crazy over the Zombie Lynn story. No one cares about an undead gang member, but everybody hates a big corporation. I told you. This doesn't make any sense. You handed them a huge story. Altor handed them money. Couldn't you force Valderrama to do something? I'll see what I can do, but we're gonna need some proof beyond a couple bodies. You came to me with this whole thing. You got any other ideas? If they want proof, our best bet is to get our hands on the chemicals while Altor is moving them. All right, let's go. There's the chemical truck. All right. Let's take it. All right, get in the back and cover us. 
Ultor isn't gonna like losing a shipment. Let's stash this thing at the airport until we get a hold of Jane. They sent the scout prototype? <laughs> wow. Scout prototype? What the hell are you talking about? It's Eric Griffin's pet project. He wanted an ATV to scout for prime mining locations. Why does a mining vehicle need a goddamn turret? Hey, you gotta blast through rock. Makes sense to me. What the hell are you people planning on mining? Trust me, you wouldn't believe me if I told you. There, just buy us a little more time. What the hell are you doing? You gotta keep these guys off us. Jane, come on, it's a great story. I want an interview. What? Corporate greed stories are a dime a dozen. I want something more. A whistleblower endangering their lives for justice. That's how you get ratings. I don't know if she'll go for it. Then I'm not running your story. Fine, I'll go talk to her. I don't like this. It's just an interview. It's live TV. Anything can happen. I got shot at getting this shit for you, and now you're telling me you're nervous about being interviewed? It's stressful. No. People trying to kill you is stressful. Listen, smartass. You have no idea how hard it is to be in front of the camera. Did you see me on Fuzz? Yeah, but you didn't care if you did a bad job. All you had to do was kill a ninja with a chainsaw. True. Look, let's just get this over with, okay? Again. In. Out. What the hell 
are you doing? I'm relaxing. You really that afraid of looking like a fool on national television? <sighs> You're not helping. Wait, what did you expect? You'll be fine. Can't you just imagine people in their underwear? Uh-uh. That won't work. I've got a thing with nudity. Then I guess you're fucked. <sighs> Again, not helping. can hold out here. I had the saints stashed in supplies in case shit went bad. God damn. Wait here, Tara. I'm gonna check and make sure no one's coming. Stay close to me, Tara. Looks like Altor wants to shut you up bad. Hold up, Jane's calling. My crew is already waiting for you. Find their truck, and I'll meet you there.
Listen, I'm running behind. Just wait for me on the slopes below Mount Claflin. I'll be there soon. All right. We'll be here. This is Jane Valderrama, reporting live with Terra, a woman who claims our city is in danger. That's right, Jane. The Oltor Corporation has been using a secret R&D lab to conduct unethical experiments on the citizens of Stillwater. Those are some strong allegations. I'm assuming you have proof. Oh, absolutely. I mean, I have the bodies of people who were experimented on, as well as some of the chemicals that were used to do it. And why do you think Ultor is responsible? I conducted the experiments myself. So these were the acts of a crazed individual? Excuse me? You said that you conducted the experiments. Well, yeah, but... So you admit that you perverted science to serve your own twisted desires. No! Ultor was the one that was... It's an all-too-familiar tale. A beautiful woman takes a job at a multi-billion dollar global corporation hoping to fulfill her dreams of microbiology, only to find herself disgusted at her failure to ascend the corporate ladder and turns to mad science in order to blackmail her employer. I'm Jane Valderrama, Channel 6 News. Why did you do that? I thought you were going to help us. Journalistic integrity doesn't pay the rent, Terra. You just humiliated me in public. I just made the saints a lot of money. Listen, honey, Altor was going to bury this story anyway. At least this way we got a little something out of it. Altor isn't going away. You'll have plenty of time to plot your little revenge scheme. Don't worry, I will. <laughs> 